you want? I am Navarro. I was sent by Don Alvaro, who told me to speak to you about the removal of horses you were supposed to deliver. The removal of horses? I delivered them a couple of hours ago. <laughs> I'm afraid that's not what Don Alvaro says. He agrees that you took the money, oh yes. But you never gave him the horses. Para Dios! You did not live up to the pact, senor! You know I'm honest. Alvaro is feeding a bunch of lies to you. <laughs> hey, muchachos, you hear that? No. Esto es su nombre honesto. <laughs> <laughs> Pero basta, viejo. Hand over the money and spare yourself the trouble of getting murdered. Stand aside, Navarro. Let me pass, you hear? <laughs> bueno, chico, get the money. Everything's all right now. Hello, Uncle Dan. Django. 
Mary and me, we decided to leave this house. We can't go on living here. We're going to move to San Juan. You'll come with us, won't you? No. And you're staying, too. Our father loved this house. He never would have left it. Not for anything. Not for anybody. May as well not even try. Why don't you put it down? You know father didn't use it. I know. Django. For heaven's sakes, don't. They'll kill you. Don't go, Django. Adios. Django! Django, stay here! Please! I don't want to lose you, too! Don't go, Django! With a bag on your shoulders? Yes, a leather bag. Stupid cow, tell me why you didn't call me! <laughs> Son, 
Stole from me my money. Por Dios, the boy robbed me. Me! How can we believe that? You heard Navarro. Un hombre. Un vero hombre. Any one of you who sees Chico, my son, I give the orders to murder him. Two days. And we still haven't laid eyes on Navarro. If he won't come here, we will have to go there, Johnny. Rojo. Bring us some wine. Yes, Don Alvaro. It is very hot this evening. Isn't it, Johnny? That's right, Don Alvaro. Mighty hot. I think Navarro has tricked us. Dolores! Tequila! Hurry up! You can stay with me until Navarro gets back. Let go of me, you pig! <laughs> you hear that? <laughs> she was right! Pig! I'm Django, looking for Navarro. Why, he's riding after his son who stole some money from him. Where's he headed? Uh, down the road, south. Whoever killed my son, step forward. I said, or I'll kill you one at a time. You now 
have two minutes to decide to talk. Step forward! He'll kill every man in the village. It won't be easy. There are people around here who can handle guns just as good as they can. And don't you forget it, Judy. And don't you forget they got Smith. He'll wind up talking. No, he won't. The two minutes have run out! Get him! <laughs> Go on. Get over there. Well, what's the matter? The Lotto! You found it easy to kill my father. That right, Navarro? But I don't know what you are talking about, gringo. It's time you learned. We'll see, amigo. Fast with your gun, amigo. Hey, look out! <laughs> <laughs> bueno. Uh, my name is Juan Jose Vasquez de Oro. No, too complicated. Barrica to you. Man of business. Naturally, only when there is some business to be done. Eh? But I am useful and resourceful and can be a great help to you. As a matter of fact, it's lucky you ran into me today, yes. <laughs> I told you not to show up around here. Just wait until things have calmed down. I come for my share of the money. That's not part of the deal. You'll get it when we cross the border. Not now. I want it now. I don't 
I'm going to stay in this damn town one minute more than I need to. You'll be staying. For some time. <laughs> The man who just came to the village. Ever see his face? I see he knows how to manage his 45. Let's get out of here. I'm in no hurry. Here's to the money. <laughs> called Django. And Navarro, what's he been doing? He drove off south and Django's following him. Let's go, boys. What do you want? We're looking for Django. Django's not here. And we don't know where he is. That's what folks usually have to say when you're looking for someone. Well, we'll just look for ourselves, all right? What do you want? Django.
Just remember to tell your brother that Don Alvaro is on his trail. If he doesn't show up, we'll get him. Does it hurt bad? Here's nothing, Mary. Nothing. It don't matter. Navarro killed my father. Hey, bring us a bottle. I understand, amigo. So all you have to do is find the ten thousand dollars. And now old Barry has an idea. All right, Barrick. Leave it to me. <laughs> There's someone hold up in the hotel. A killer. I know the man. And he knows something about it. Now, as far as my work goes, you'll give me 10% as soon as you have the dollars in your pocket. Huh? Take it. That's not much. Saludos. Saludos, amigo. <laughs> Hope you're bringing me good news, Johnny. No news at all of Navarro. Just that Django got rid of a few of his men. Django. Django Foster. Find him tomorrow and Navarro. And not without the gold. I can hardly wait to see Django. Just make sure he's still bleeding a little. Go on. You still owe me a if I live, for this morning. I'll and yet... pay. And if I'm dead, I'll pay anyway. <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> ah, thank you. Yes, indeed. What do we do about those two? We're just going to have to make him get out of here. 
They'll only bring us trouble if they stay in town. Those men have got something in mind. I'll go out and take a look. No, stay inside. We can watch better from in here. Here's the mouse crawling out of his hole. Very big mouse, amigo. Going by, Barrica. Dollars, amigo. <laughs> now I know that Gray is who we want. There he is with the others. Just keep an eye on him. Give me a bottle. Seems the two of you are looking for that gold. Ten thousand dollars is sure a lot of money. How do you know about it? <laughs> now, Fred, don't be a fool, boy. <laughs> it can't be the full house. Everybody knows in this town. <laughs> And you mustn't cheat. And everyone knows that the man who got it is far away by now. That's funny, Mr. Gray. You know what we think. We think the gold is still here and we're going to find it. Strategy. Set him up, Akito. We've come here to advise you to go. Leave this town, hombre, before morning. <laughs> I'll leave this town when I've found my gold. You know, Navarro told everyone the gold was his, too. I don't try to cheat. <laughs> Can't cheat the old box. So get moving. What if I stay? A lot of us know how to manage a gun pretty good. I don't believe you. They're outside, waiting for you. 
you got about an hour to get out of town. looking for? Django, we're waiting for you. You've got visitors, Django. Hmm. Too many. I'll come out with you. I've got to earn that 10%. Alvar sent me here to take back the 10,000. Don't worry, we'll get that gold, Django. <laughs> ha. Who are they? They were Alvaro's men. Alvaro? That's right, Alvaro. What's he got to do with this? We'll find out, amigo. Hey! Hey, you! Listen! Listen a minute! The bodies are piling up around here, and I don't intend to work anymore on credit. So either you pay me now, or I'll just leave them where they are. That's not how it was. You'll get paid a minute we find the gold. Now get back to work. Get to work, he says. Not even Alvaro knows the money's in town. If it weren't for those two, we'd be out of here. Find Holdo. Say I've got a good piece of business and tell him to come over here quick. Um, uh, uh, 
You want to tell us about the gold? Well... Well, you see... I'd like to leave the village... with my family. Why? No one is gonna harm you. Yes, I know, sir, but I... <laughs> Get out of here, I kill you. But I'd still like to go, if I may. This was a nice place before you came. But I've got my family to think about it. Well, nobody's tying you down. But maybe it's better you look at what uh, he digs with him, eh? Huh. Uh, I have nothing to hide. Wonderful. Huh. We better start keeping a watch. You dig first. Sí, bueno. Ray, let's try now. He's gone back in. We can't, Judy. He can see everything from that window. If we make one move, he'll be on us. I was waiting for you. Well, here I am. Barry told you. Yeah, now you. Come on. We'll sit down and talk. Alvaro, what's that a drink? I have some fine bourbon. Barrett was saying there's a nice piece of work. Barrett was right. Foster and his son stole quite a lot of money from me. They were supposed to deliver a big remuda of horses, and they didn't. And to top it off, Django killed four of my men yesterday. I had 
told you more than once, Alvaro. The men you hire are good at everything. Except shooting. And I suppose that's just fine with you, amigo. This way you obviously get a percentage of the gold. You get it back for me and a thousand is yours. I'll get it. Of course, my price is 15. Alvaro's waiting for you.
If those men find out, it'll be the end. <laughs> Tomorrow morning, the stagecoach leaves for San Juan. And you'll be on it, my dear. You and the money. No one will notice you. I'll join you later. Without that money, I can go when I please. <laughs> Have a drink. tried to fool me. That's why Navarro was forced to kill him. And then your brother, little Django, took his gun and shot four of my men, but he'll get what's coming to him. All right, lock her up inside. you, senorita. Thank you. It's so hot tonight. Yes, hot. Very hot. You know, it's like an oven in there. Well, then, why is Gray inside? Isn't he hot? He's sleeping. 
Anyway, so many awful things have been going on around this place. It's better to stay where you are. You're right. And until we find that money, lots of other things are going to happen. But you mustn't be scared. After all, you have nothing to do with all this. Anyway, I'm so bored in this place. I decided I'm leaving. You mean it? Uh, when, Miss Judy? Tell me. Tomorrow, at sunup. On the stagecoach to San Juan. San Juan. What times I had there. Mm -hmm. Please come there and visit me. I'll tell you where. Gray and I'll be splitting up. We're separating tomorrow. I am sorry that you're going. I am afraid I'll be missing you very much. So please don't forget San Juan. I wouldn't want to miss you. You can count on it. As soon as we have found the gold, I'll come to San Juan. I've been away too long. Then I'll see you soon, senor. Barriga. Adios, Barriga. Adios. Jango's sister's waiting here with us. And not to come without the money. Yeah, right away. Senorita Judy. I've come to see you off. Allow me to open. May I? Thank you. Careful. Uh, well, I'll look forward to get it. Get oh! oh! I see you in San Juan. <laughs> That's right, throw it down.
Don't let him draw, Django. Get him now. Come on. Tell you, amigo, Can... no one fool's barrica. Django, that was wonderful, really wonderful. Now, at last, you can give me some money, eh, Django? Just a little. You have so much there. I've been working so hard. Please, Django. Hey, what's the matter with you, viejo? Can't you wait until we are ready? What do you mean? I'm an honest I'll business give man. you your money. I should think so after all that work. Django! Django! Don Alvaro wants to see you, alone. It's about your sister. And he says, bring along the money. Otherwise... What do you mean, otherwise? I can't say anything else. But you better just come to the ranch. What is it? What do you want? It's been some time. Django doesn't have so far to ride. It'd be smart to go down to the village. I don't believe he's going to bring that money. You'll bring it, all right. If you're so sure of that, why don't you pay us in advance? wasn't part of our deal. If you want nothing more to do with it, get out. You've cheated me for the last time, Alvaro. Who do you think you're talking to?
We took care of them all. <laughs> Django will be here in a minute with the gold. Now, well, very good work, my friend. I'm sorry about your 10%. Alvaro wants it all now. Don't worry, Django. The life of your sister is far more important. Adios, amigo. Adios. for your funeral if you ever die. What more can you ask for, huh? <laughs> well, I've got news for you. Tubs of lard like you die first. I'm going to rob your pockets and just leave you lying in the middle of the street. Yes, I will. <laughs>
You were very smart to come, Django. Now get off your horse. I said get off it. Two of you. Now, Varl told me you'd be here. It was the last thing he said before he died. What was that? He tried to put one over on me. And so... Better not try any other tricks, Django. If you've really got the money inside that sack, we're going to be all right. I got the money here, Hondo. Just stop right there. Off with that gun. I mean now. Django. Bring the bag, Django.
Django! It's all over, Mary. All over. They used to call me the Man of Iron. <laughs> he could have hit you in the head. Look at this. My head is even tougher. <laughs> Thanks for the gun. 